I don't think this is going to be a period of great transatlantic activism. I think it will be four years of transatlantic inertia, might be putting it too strongly, but perhaps retrenchment. In the United States, there is a pressing sense of overextension, that it's time to lighten the load, that it's time to get out of the quagmire in the Middle East. In Europe, there's no sense of overstretch because there's no stretch. <laughs> Europe has been sitting on a nice, comfortable sofa, and it will continue to sit in that nice, comfortable sofa. So when I look at these next four years, yes, there will be transatlantic comedy, there will be partnership, but I don't see a whole lot of activism. I see the United States going through a period of rebuilding, retrenchment, and respite, not one in which it reaches across the Atlantic to its partners on the other side and goes off and tries to solve many, many problems. Iran is the one exception to that. That looms on the horizon. Uh, and I, I think unless there's a deal, the prospect of war is, is high in the second half of 2013. But other than that, I think we will see the United States and Europe actually backing off from the Arab Spring, staying out of Syria, realizing that they don't have as much control over events on the ground as many would hope. And in that respect, the issues that Andy mentioned where there will be cooperation and, and parallel interests, I think he's right. I just don't think there's going to be much action. Is Obama really going to go after global zero? Doubtful. Is Obama, when we're trying to get the economy going, really going to push forward a big policy on climate change? I don't think so. <clears throat> Is he really going to stick his neck out to advance the peace process when a new coalition between Netanyahu and Lieberman is likely to prevail for the foreseeable future? I don't think so. He tried that before and he banged his head up against a brick wall. So all of the things that I think are areas of potential transatlantic cooperation, and I think Andy put his finger on them, I'm just not sure they're going to be very active. 